Three important tips for making your own dinky flowers from the trash. First off, remember that you can use recycled number six polystyrene plastic, just like you would use commercial trinketings. However, if you want to mark on it with paint pens, then you're gonna need to lightly sand it with a fine grit sandpaper so the paint has something to grab onto. Just don't forget to seal the painted side once it's shrunk. Number two, layers are our friends. You can either stack individual petals or groups of petals like you see here. Not only does this give us depth and dimension, but most importantly, it'll allow for number three. To attach our layers together, we're gonna use a hard connection point like a rivet, grommet, or in this particular case, eyelets. When polystyrene shrinks down, it also gets thicker. So when our layers are sandwiched by the eyelet, they smooch together when it shrinks, causing them to want to splay out and curl up instead of settling back down to flat. Not only that, but our eyelet can also serve as a pass-through point for our flowers, which paired with a bead will let us use our dinks as a button or a jewelry without even needing glue. Or do what I did here and skip the hole entirely and epoxy them to some posts and mount them to the wall so that now every eyelet has an eye and they all see you.